Mongols have taken Lord Shimura captive. Mm. He will endure. He is strong and resilient, skilled in the art of combat and poetry. Do you practice haiku, my lord? There is no time during war. War is the reason to make time. Haiku allows one to concentrate, eliminate chaos. To find peace. Precisely. My favorite place to write lies atop the cliff. It is one of many such places. If you look, you will find inspiration all across Tsushima. I hope I can find quiet places like this one, untouched by war. Look for the birds. They will show you the way. Sakai! Sensei, any word on Tomoe? Yes, but I'm not sure you are ready for her. You make her sound like a demon. That's not far off the mark. Tomoe is fearless. She is not samurai, but she is a born killer. I know the type. No, you do not. Come. Where are we headed? An archery range. The locals saw Mongols training there. I suspect Tomoe was with them. If Tomoe is truly fearless, she'd make a useful ally. A starving leopard is fearless too. Leopards can't master your way of the bow. Let it go, Sakai. She will never join us. Why did she turn against you? I took a risk sharing all I knew with her. When she betrayed my trust, I punished her. It must have been harsh. You saw what she did to the prisoners at Fort Nakayama. That was no mistake. That was a choice. And not the first time she's made it. We don't know it was her fault. You don't. I do. You have to climb to get there. Sure you can make it, Sensei? What are you waiting for, Saka? You need a hand, Sensei? Not bad, Sakai. You said the only way up was to climb. No. I said you had to climb. It's good exercise. Arrows, Mongol and Japanese. If they were here, they're long gone. We might pick up their trail by the practice target. There is no target.
Near that watchtower. Not bad, Sensei. Find out where they went. Move it, Sakai. How many Mongols is Tomoe training? A severed head, used for target practice. Sensei, Mongols here. Good work, Sakai. Resting your bow arm, Sensei? Observing your response to an ambush. You knew those Mongols were still here? Yes. You didn't think to mention it? If you can't handle a few Mongols, what good will you be against Tomoe? This is war, not a test. And how many wars have you fought? I'll test you as I see fit. I can see why Tomoe attacked you. <laughs> now, where did she go, Sakai? I'll look around. A lot of tracks. A dozen men. Maybe more. Follow the trail. If we catch her, do not wait for me. Attack and keep moving, or you'll die. Do you plan to use your bow this time? If we find her. And if not? Can you take a dozen enemy soldiers without me? If I must. Good answer. Oh! 
Did you see a Japanese woman with these Mongols? I couldn't, the sensei. And the hot springs, that's all I heard, my lord. Forgive me. Monster out of hunt. They heard Tomoe giving orders to the Mongols. She mentioned Hiyoshi Springs. She's just getting started. Sakai, the way you fight, it's not your uncle's way, and it's not mine. We've never faced an enemy like this. I do what I must to defeat them. A samurai is a guardian, not a killer who darts around like a thief. You didn't see Komodo. I've seen enough! I know it was brutal, but I won't train another monster. I know. I won't let that happen. If Tomoe is going after Yoshi Springs, I need to prepare. So do you. I'll see you at my dojo, Sakai. Some say they know every secret on this island. I wonder where it's going. Any news of Tomoe? Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. People are afraid to leave or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? Hmm. A few archers at strategic points can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Tomoe was a good student. Too good? We're fighting your own reflection. We will turn that to our advantage. Come. How do you propose we find these archers? We think like Tomoe.
We want to control movement in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. Where do we put archers? It would be smart to control the main entrance into town. Mm, people already avoid the main road. Archers there would be wasted. That path behind the inn? No. Poor cover, no clear lines of sight. You want to cover the largest territory with the fewest archers. A handful of men could shut down the road to the coast. Yes. I would want someone looking over the bridge into town. So would I. The road south runs along for you. Let's go hunting. What else did you teach, Tomo? I held back nothing. Including why you left Clan Nago? That's no secret. The signs are retired, and the hot spring suited me. But you continued to teach. What changed your mind? Putting it down felt like death, so I chose to live. But do you regret giving up a warrior's life? Mastery of the bow is mastery of oneself. That is the only victory worthy of a samurai. The rest is noise. We're getting close. Eyes open. Innocent travelers. Murdered. Let's help their killers follow them across the Sansu River. Hey. Looking for me? Those innocent, dead. Tomoe has thrown everything away. Betrayed her people. She is a traitor because the Mongols offer power, wealth, status. Things denied her by birth. Tomoe knew she was born to a lower station than she deserved. Now you're being too kind. Kindness can be useful, even to a warrior. Who told you that? Sun Tzu? My uncle. And he didn't tell me. He showed me. Mercy creates a debt. Your uncle showed mercy to people who pose no danger to him. A safe bet. Have 
ambush! Snake nest to find. Come. How did Tomoe become your student? She showed up at my dojo with her father's makeshift hunting bow and refused to leave. You didn't turn her away. I tried, but she sank arrow after arrow into my targets. I had never seen talent like hers. She must have had training. Her form was wrong. Would have been useless in a real fight. But she had no fear of missing a shot. She never hesitated. A warrior's spirit? No. A killer's. I didn't see until it was too late. Come here and fight! Sensei Ishikawa! You know the name Ishikawa? I do. I have message. Speak. Sensei, all of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy, like the victims of Hironori Naga. Silence! <laughs> Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. <sighs> we'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there and be ready to fight.
How is your armor fitting now? This will keep you safe. Farewell. Armor like that will never fail you. Sakai! We must deal with Tomoe's threat against Yoshi Springs before it's too late. I don't understand the fixation on the town. I was born there. Destroying it proves her worth to the Mongols. And humiliates me. But the terrain works in our favor. Two skilled archers can hold off hundreds. Or... We allow the Mongols to take it. Tomoe wins a victory and lets her guard down. Then we strike. 
Sacrifice Hiyoshi Springs for Tomoe. The sacrifice is worth it! Tomoe would agree, Sensei. Fine, Sakai. She will attack from the north. We should focus our efforts there. Scout elevated positions, place arrows, and... Listen! Did you hear that? One arrow, one death! Tomoe's new friends would visit. If the point was to kill us, she would have sent more men. Or the point was not to kill, but to delay. Yoshi Springs, the attack is starting. This way! If I fall today, promise me you will keep hunting Tomoe. I promise, Sensei. She knows you're my student. Your death will destroy my legacy. Your way of the bow will survive with me. Where will Tomoe strike? In the back town, near the waterfalls. The most vulnerable point. If we get there before the Mongols, we can prepare a defense, but it won't be easy. It never is. You two, come here! What is it, my lords? Mongols are heading for Hiroshi Springs. Gather everyone at the inn and stay out of sight. We will deal with them. Yes, my lords. Good sight lines over here. The Mongols won't be able to flank us. We don't have much time. What can we use to our advantage? Not many options. We'll exploit the ones we have. Hornet's nests. Excellent distraction. Dry grass. Lure the Mongols in. We'll make sure you have flaming arrows. Those barrels could do some damage. Take these flaming arrows. And try not to burn yourself, or me. Then don't get in my way, Sensei. Get ready. The Mongols will be here soon. They're getting closer. Good. Let's demonstrate the way of the bow for them. They're coming downhill. Take them. One arrow, one death, Sensei. Not bad. I'm 
ready for more. So are they. Coming down the main road. I've got them. now. Huh. There she is. That's Tomoe? Burning the Nagao banner. We can catch her. Oh, she'll be long gone by the time we get there. She's a coward. No. She's mocking me. She knows the last student I trained before her was Hironori Nagao. You said he wasn't your student. Which is it? I was young, prideful, callous. Hironori learned from my example. He led a rebellion to seize the clan and lost but only after butchering Lord Nagao's best men. Hironori didn't die fighting bandits. That was a story to protect Nagao's legacy. There was no saving mine. As his teacher, I could never be trusted again. I was granted the mercy to resign my position. I convinced myself the way of the bow had to survive. But the truth is, I am a coward who should have ended it long ago. You told Tomoe all of this. I wanted her to understand what it meant for me to teach again. 
and like everything else, she turned it against me. You'll never redeem Hironori Nago, and you won't change Tomoe. But today, you saved the people of Hiyoshi Springs. With my new student. I'll need you at Castle Canada. My bow is yours, but Tomoe isn't done yet. We must keep hunting her. We will, Sensei. <laughs>